The Breda Bar.65 Nibio was a low-wing, multi-role, fighter, reconnaissance, assault single-engine monoplane manufactured by the Italian firm Ernesto Breda. Designed by engineers Antonio Perano and Giuseppe Panzeri, who used the previous Breda Bar.64 design as a basis. The prototype, single-seater and powered by an Isotta Fraschini K14 radial engine, flew for the first time in September 1935. The first flight and the following ones gave excellent results, so it was ordered in series. A second series that mounted the more powerful 1,000 horsepower Fiat A80 engine proved to be less reliable due to the considerable problems that afflicted this engine. The undercarriage had its front legs retractable into underwing nacelles. The pilot had a closed cockpit, equipped with a sliding glass canopy. The armament consisted of four machine guns installed in the wing plane, plus one for the observer in the two-seater version. It had an internal bomb bay and underwing attachments. In dive bombing, with bombs loaded on the underwing hooks, the Breeder Bar 65 was decidedly effective, and aiming maneuvers were simple and precise. Allowing dives up to 80 degrees and being an excellent platform for both firing automatic weapons and dive bomb releases. The destruction of the Flix Bridge over the Ebro River by a patrol of only three single-seat bar, 65s remained famous. So the Regia Aeronautica already had an excellent ground attack aircraft in 1937, capable of a speed of 430 km per hour. In some ways superior to the Ju-87 Stukas. Due to the limited financial resources and the undecided attitude of the Regia Aeronautica, which could not be resolved between strategic and tactical bombing, wasting economic resources, only a few examples were ordered. It was counted on the fact that further projects were in development which appeared to be a substantial step forward. In reality, the new projects were not developed quickly and the Regia Aeronautica was forced to be assigned a hundred Junkers Ju 87s because it did not have a good number of Italian aircraft available to fill the assault role. In fact, the fighters that moved to the second line because they were obsolete were employed in this role, such as the Fiat County Route 32, the Fiat County Route 42, the Fiat G50, the McKee 200. A real pity because if instead of closing the Breeder Bar 65 Nibio production line, if it had been opted for its modernization with a more powerful and reliable radial engine, a modernization which had already been put in the pipeline by the engineer Pirano, the Regia Aeronautica would have had a highly effective attack aircraft available on a continuous basis. I want to mention here that in 1940 and 1941, the kite was considered a mortal danger by the Desert Long Range Group and the British Eighth Army. Its use in quantity would have inhibited and cancelled the ability to move, jeopardizing the compass operation. In particular, before his sudden death, Italo Balbo, governor and head of Italian military operations in Libya, had prepared a series of operations in this sense. Operations that were not carried out by his successors, leading to a paralysis of the Italian initiative which was soon paid bitterly by the Royal Army, with the military operation Compass and the collapse of the front.